Hey guys, it's Hetty and welcome back to my channel. So for today, I'm actually going to do the Draw This Again challenge and yeah, this is from 2008. Picture of Ichigo Kurosaki from Bleach, if you don't know what that anime is. Um, this was probably the height of my watching anime and getting into drawing it sort of stage and uh, yeah, let's see how we can improve this. There's going to be a few little changes but I'm going to keep to basically the same same pose that he's in and I'm going to use the same mediums so it's just pencil and pencil crayons and a fine liner. So yeah, let's see how this goes. When I started the piece I really wanted to make sure that I try and do it as close to the, my drawing style that I do now and not just a complete replica of Ichigo's actual character design because even though I do like his character design that wasn't really what I was going for with this piece. I know when I originally drew out the little chibi style version all I was doing then was trying to copy that style but that was because my drawing skills were really lacking then and I that's one thing I had to do to learn to draw and it was just that stage I was at at the time. Whereas now I've been practicing anatomy a lot more, but I made the biggest rookie mistake ever when it came to doing this piece because I tried to squish the whole body on the page. And as all of you artists out there will know, that is like the worst mistake you could ever do because then everything just goes wrong. And I managed to make it work, sort of, um, but I will do this piece again in the future, but on a bigger piece of paper, because that really limited me. I mean, it limited the detail I could put in the face with the size I was doing, because this is only an A5 sketchbook that I'm working in. So it, it, couldn't, it could have been a lot better than it is. It's still a heck of an improvement from the original piece, so I'm not going to complain there, but it's not what I was hoping it would turn out to be just because I tried to squish it all on the page and I felt limited as well by the fact that I was using only the same medium that I used in the original because I don't do literally just pencil crayon drawings anymore because I have access to more different art supplies whereas back then I had my pencil crayons and possibly a cheap set of like felt tip markers like water based ones and then pencils and acrylic paint that was all I had at the time whereas now I have a ton more art supplies so I think next time as well when I do this I won't limit myself to the art supplies I use but at least there is improvement there that's one thing I can say um, but we're not far from the end of the video now so I hope you enjoyed this video and if you have any requests for videos you want to see in the future then please comment down below because I'm trying to get a load of videos done in advance ready for when the baby comes just so then I've still got videos coming out for you guys they're not going to be like two or three videos a week I mean I know I'm not doing that right now but it might be a little bit slower like some weeks I may end up missing some but I'm hoping I can get enough videos done in advance so I'll at least have a month's worth in supply just so I've got videos and content for you. But yeah, if you have any video requests then please leave a comment down below. But other than that, I hope you enjoyed the video and please like and subscribe and I will see you next time. Bye!